I am Chef Hannes. I am the king of pork, or in my mind I am. Pork came into my life as a teenager. Being raised in a Jewish household, it wasn't available. Once I first tasted it, there was no looking back. I've been a chef for about 25 years. I always had a lot of pork on my menu. I wanted to create five dishes using the Chairman's Reserve all-natural pork rack, and I was able to achieve so many different flavors and textures. For the first dish, I did a chorizo stuffed pork chop. So I actually took the pork chop, diced it up, and made our own chorizo from it. And then stuffed that back into the pork chop. Did a nice sear and roasted it off in the oven. Came out perfect. For the side dish, I took some corn, charred it, and made a really nice cream corn that paired really well with the spice of the chorizo inside. And all the flavors together just really came together. The finished texture was really meaty on the outside and spicy and moist on the inside from the chorizo. What I look for in pork is the color. I like it where it's a little bit deeper color, not so light pink, because I know it's been fed right and it was processed correctly. For the second dish, I made a rub using some of the Spiceology spices. Then I rubbed that over the pork rack, put it into the smoker using oak and gave it a nice light smoke, took a couple hours. Then I took some of the fat that I had from the pork, rendered it down and then used that fat to roast the potatoes and the Brussels sprouts that became a hash. Working with Tyson, Chairman's Reserve has been very fun. The marbling, the color of the meat, and the nice texture makes it a pleasure every day when you get to see what you're working with. The next dish, I took the pork rack, I cleaned all the bones off of it to make what is essentially a pork loin. I rubbed it in a Spiceology Chad White butt rub that we use at TT's Barbecue. And then I use the fat that I cleaned off to render out, and then that is what I clean feed the pork loin in. I use that same fat for my side dish on it, which consisted of caramelized cannelloni beans and made a puree done up with a little bit of fresh herb. The Tyson Chairman's Reserve Pork Rack has so much marbling that using it in its own fat to confit it just really brought out its own natural flavor and the texture was as smooth as butter. For this dish, I wanted to brine the pork, which generally comes when you use less marbled meat, but this one had so much marbling, I was able to do the brine in six hours and achieve the flavor I wanted. And then I slow roasted it to allow the sugars from the brine to caramelize, yet keeping all that marbling and moisture that comes with the Chairman's Reserve intact. Then I paired it with a three grain rice cake that I've pan fried to add a crispy texture to the dish. For the next dish, my version of Milanesa, I took the pork chop, pounded it flat, did a traditional breading station, and then did a pan fry with it. So it got crunchy on the outside, but all the marbling that comes with the Chairman's Reserve just kept the texture and the flavor at its peak. And then I paired it with a San Marzano tomato compote. As a corporate chef for a restaurant group and many different restaurants and styles of food, the consistent ability to have higher end product from Tyson Chairman Reserve allows me to be creative as a chef, ensuring my customer satisfaction. 